What up, squad? Welcome back to another episode of AONR Draws. It's your friendly neighborhood, RoboRiv, back at it again. With this drawing, this is a drawing that you guys, the viewers, voted on. And this uh, poll was called You Choose, I Draw. This was poll number five. What You Choose, I Draw is, if you don't know, if this is your first time checking out one of my videos, uh, it's a basically a poll where I combine my love of action figure photography and my love of drawing. Uh, two things I can't get enough of. And what I do is I show some uh, cool snapshots that I've uh, taken before and let you guys, uh, I usually choose only up to about four and let you guys choose which one I'm gonna redraw in my style. And literally how I, I do these is I have my main tablet that I'm working on that I created this drawing on in Procreate. Uh, and I look at a picture of, uh, of the picture that I took either on my phone or on my other tablet, and I redraw it. I, I just draw the way, draw what I see, but draw it in my, uh, in the way that I know how to draw. So <laughs> uh, that's pretty much the gist of it. Uh, sometimes I change a few things, like with this one, I zoomed in a little bit more than the actual drawing, or the actual photo, rather. Um, and made uh, some minor adjustments to the anatomy uh, as well. Uh, that's mostly because with figures, there's just, if I were to draw it exactly how uh, it was in the photo, A, it wouldn't be a whole lot of fun for me because it's just, at that point, I might as well just trace the whole, the whole image. But um, also there's just a level of uh, fluidity that's missing with the action figures because action figures have limited articulation. So uh, you don't want to, at least I don't want to do a, a carbon copy of it. Um, and that's something too, I just, that's kind of how I've always, my, my approach to art has always been. I, I don't necessarily like doing carbon copies of, of um, and there's some artists that are, look, I don't, I don't knock them if you're great at, doing portraits and they look like a dang photo go for it like i admire that stuff as well but i just don't have fun doing it i would rather uh go after the image i see in my mind's eye and, and try to do that and uh and change things and alter things even if i'm going uh if i'm doing a drawing based off of something like another image which that's initially what this is it's a it's based off of the photo um i always want to find some cool ways to to change it around and make it more to my specifications um this would be a cool fight too like i, I would be interested in seeing <laughs> a good old bane versus uh eddie brock venom uh i think that that would uh, who do you guys think will win uh, i'd like to I'd like to know your guys' input on that. Um, would it be Bane and his Venom or would it be Venom and his Venom? Uh, who would win that fight? Um, especially this big burly monster Venom. Uh, I don't, I draw like my, my, my usual take on Venom is pretty big and burly, but it's a bit different from this take that I'm doing right, right now. I, I did want to kind of keep the look of this Venom uh, similar enough to the figure that I was drawing it. And it's the, the, the figure it's based off of is the Marvel Legends Monster Venom. And honestly, like there's another Venom figure. If you guys are, I'm gonna go on a little bit of a toy rant just real, real quick. Um, if you guys are Marvel Legends fans out there. There's another Venom uh, that they're releasing for the 80th, or is it 85th? I think it's 85th anniversary Marvel figures. It's a new classic card back Venom. He looks really cool. I may be showing a picture of him right now on screen. Um, he looks cool, but man, I'm gonna have to pass on him. A, because I'm, I'm really trying to slow down my collection hobby, because it's just, the time, the space, and the um, the disposable income. I just don't have it like I used to. <laughs> so I've got to kind of push the brakes a little bit on that. And also, I, 
I have too many versions of Venom as it is. I, I it's kind of funny because that's one of the figures that really got me back into le- into collecting Marvel figures. Um, I had stopped collecting for for quite a while, um, several years ago, and it wasn't until I moved back to Nebraska and um, I had purchased a I don't remember if I bought it or if it was a gift but I somehow obtained the uh, the initial Marvel Legends Venom figure <clears throat> and I'll show a picture of that on screen right now too <clears throat> I had um, I purchased that figure and or I received that figure and I was blown away by the articulation and the look the classic look of it and it was like the Venom that I remember and they just kept making better versions of them. <laughs> so I just kept uh, collecting newer versions. And now I've got way too many Venoms. Same with Wolverine. I've got too many Wolverines now. But speaking of action figures, uh, stick around at the very end of this video. I will post the next uh, four choices for You Choose I Draw. This time it'll be You Choose I Draw poll number six. And... I don't know which uh, which photos to pick. I'm gonna have to, as I'm recording this, I, I haven't figured that out yet. So after this is done, I'll have to uh, look in my uh, look in my photo library and see what is worthy enough for a uh, for for this upcoming poll. So stick around. You'll see those choices, and uh, yeah, let me know in the comments. Bane versus Venom. Who wins? Um, also, it'd be kind of cool to do some more crossovers, some more DC versus Marvel crossover picks. What do you guys think? Let me know. I also want to say real quick, give myself a little bit of a pat on the back. We have done it, guys. We are, we are we've made it more episodes than my initial run of this channel when I started off as Rivers Art Draws. Uh, actually, we, we beat that. We, we surpassed those at that episode number quite a few episodes ago. But it just dawned on me today. Hey, you know, I, I've, I've stuck with this longer than I than than the last time I tried to do it. So I'm pretty happy about that. Uh, I hope to keep sticking around with it. Hopefully we'll get to doing this year rounded up and do a whole nother season of uh, AONR draws next year. Hopefully I can keep it up. It's it's looking very interesting. I, I took a look at my schedule <laughs> this morning uh, as far as my comic stuff I'm, I'm working on. I'm like, I don't know how I'm going to do all of this, how I'm going to juggle all of this at the same time, but we'll figure it out. If you enjoyed this please let me know hit me up with a like on this video it helps with the whole algorithm and suggesting it to other people um if you'd like to see more episodes more or these little time lapse videos uh, don't forget to hit that subscribe button uh, hopefully i've earned that today with this video hopefully i earned your subscription and you'll be back for more episodes of A1R Draws. Check me out on all my social media. Love you guys. Peace. You choose. I draw. If you know anything about me, you know, I get a kick out of posing my figures and taking what I think are pretty neat snapshots of them. Sometimes they even inspire some of my artwork. That's why I'm doing a little poll to see which one of my photos should I redraw, remix, reimagine as a pinup. So for this one, your choices are an X-Men trio featuring Psylocke, Cyclops, and Wolverine. The Jokerize Justice League versus the Justice League. Sagat facing off against Ryu. And everyone's favorite Darkstalker Dimitri. 
voting ends June 22nd, 2024. Make sure you leave your choice either in the comments of this video or on my Instagram, either the Art of Nick Rivers Instagram or catch me on my other Instagram, Omni Rivers.